let's um, yeah and automate the time let's actually put it here because it doesn't need to operate let's make it play make it go from 18 milliseconds to oh, crap again this fuck I want move one point not two stupid Oh yeah, nice. Now let's add a <laughs> crash. It's weird, I have DSP load at 23%, it's not too much, but Ardor is just can't keep up with the amount of files, I think, in this session, just, yeah. Oh yes, MA pitch shift, that's the, that's the whole thing. That's the key to success, man. And also it's gonna give us a simple Stereo image. It's gonna be awesome. MA pitch shift ratio. We can use this as a build up sound. Yeah, that's the idea. Let's go from the very low to. to. How about also. Automating the win window size, because that's going to sound very weird and cool. Yay, this could work, I think. Alrighty, let's maybe cut this with all its automation. Control X and paste it. Here. <laughs> yes, this is this is working. Let's just use any Q. <laughs> or maybe I, I think I want to change one more thing about this. Make one. Okay, let's uh, cut off the lows. Gently. Yeah, it's very, very subtle. Great, it adds to the feel of the track and makes it more interesting. My goodness. Are you with me, Ardor? OBS, you're recording this. Okay, I think I want to copy this thing and use it somewhere else, but I just would like to listen first. Yeah, maybe here. I think here would be a good idea to use this. Copy, 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 control C. And uh, control V, C. Is there any other? Let's try to use it here too. Why not? Maybe. 
Maybe let's give it more velocity. V for velocity. Oh my god, I don't know how the recording's gonna look. It's probably gonna be terrible. <laughs> I think I'm gonna automate the ratio to be go higher. I want to make it super, super high. All right, let's, uh, I think we just need a few more small sound effects and this track is done. And well, then some um, final mix down session, like paying attention to levels of different frequencies and, and instruments. A final look at dynamics and over loudness. Uh, and I think I'm gonna render it out and then master it and send it out. Whew. Exciting. Okay, let's call this FX4. Whatever it's gonna be. Now oh, this is FX3. This is FX4 actually. Oh, this is FX. Okay, so this is gonna be FX5. Uh, actually, no, let's call this pre noise or riser. That's what it's, that's what it's called by peoples. <coughs> All right, let's give it keyboard input again. At a mono to stereo splitter. Yay. Great. <laughs> huh, maybe I could try save this session and reload it. Maybe it's gonna our door's gonna work faster. I'm really tempted to try it because it's taking so long to do anything now. This is artificially slowed down. My work is artificially slowed down. Okay. I'm saving the session. Saving the session. Yeah. My goodness, it's an amazingly bad. I'm gonna quit. I'm gonna quit Ardor. Mm. And I'm going to run it again. Maybe I'm just gonna minimize this bot line. Actually using it. Waiting for the shit to load. Waiting for my shit to load, yeah, yeah. Hello. Bodacious eleven. <clears throat> uh, I keep loading, 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 loading. <laughs> Loading, still, still loading. Okay, loaded. Oh my goodness, I'm like eating 14 gigs of RAM just to run this session, what the heck? What's going on with you? Okay, well, let's see, it's gonna be more responsive maybe? <laughs> Not really. <laughs> oh, this, this didn't do shit, didn't do snot. <sighs> well. Sounds like a flute. Let's try a different algorithm. This just looks interesting.
Something's really bad. The envelopes are very... Very bad. Okay, let's try. Okay, let's go with all this one. Let's see what we can do. Okay. Oh, nice. Sounds like a stick. Cool. This could be useful. Maybe I can insert some small melodies with this thingy. Add some reverb or something. What the f... No, I'm gonna wait. Let me wait. Come on, Ardor, you can do it. I really wanna... I want to make a track for this, this challenge, so please cooperate. Okay, shall you? Can you? Will you? <sighs> Hello, motherfucker. Oh, yeah. We're alive. Great. Actually, I'm gonna save. <coughs> oh my goodness. Clicking anything just takes forever. Because I'm gonna save a new version in case something breaks this session. I wanna have a snapshot. Yeah, and I can just go and make myself some tea. It's gonna take a while. 12 excruciating minutes later. Holy shit, it's done. Uh. I turned off the screen for a while and didn't realize it, it's... I just did move it, open it up, and whoa, it's done! Awesome! I can actually work on it again. Nice. Oh, why is... Ba ba da da da. Ba da da. Ba da da da. <laughs> I wanted to make it slow. <laughs> that melody is frantic. Okay, let's try to stretch it. Oh. Doesn't work so bad, so good. <laughs> Let's see. Oh man. <laughs> that's that's interesting. Very interesting. Okay, I'm gonna now just try to snap every note to a reasonable place. Okay, let's move this back. Oh, interesting. How about moving this all up one octave? Yeah, interesting, yeah. I like this rhythm. It was weird, but it's nice. I like it. Okay, how about using Cscape? Because it's doing this nice chromatic resonances and a delay. I like it. BPM. What BPM do we have? I forgot. Around 70. Five minus seventy-four. Oh, it it did it catch that. Well, nice.
Okay. I think uh, I think it could take a mono input. Oh, shite. Uh, okay, gotta, gotta fix this shit. Remove the outputs. Yay. Now let's fucking distort it, because why not? That's what we do. That's what I will, that's what we do for a living. Distort the shit out of things. All right, I'm gonna try to use a compressor before. No, just an amplifier. And the uh, amplifier, this one. I think I should make it in my favorites, but I have too many favorites plugins, so it's no, oh, it's not gonna work. Okay, let's add 24 decibels. Oh, 20 is the max. Oh yeah, nice, like it. I also want to add some noise. So let's go. Fractal. Ah. Uh. Yep. <laughs> mm, yeah, and let's ah. uh, set a gate. <laughs> oh, interesting. Let's see what happens. Good. I like it, so it just, yeah. I forgot about one channel. Um, not again. How about strict IO, fuckers? Okay, nice. Better now. Maybe I should, oh. Crap, but now I want to, I want stereo. Oh. Routing grid, left, right, okay. Inputs. Crap. I want stereo. How do I do that? Okay, let's add an audio out. I can't duplicate it. Fuck. <laughs> oh my goodness. That's... Okay. This ain't gonna fly. Pick your poison, man. Can't have it work easy. What? You fucking kidding me? White can't be removed. Oh. <laughs> All right, let's do this like this. Fuck it. <laughs> Okay, maybe it can be removed because it was used. Something was connected to it. Okay. I want some reverb. Let's use GX Zeta reverb again. Yay, nice. Oh, I love this reverb. It's so smooth. And just compress it. Oh, also, an equalizer. We don't want some bass frequencies to be there and mess up with the rest of the mix. I just have a high pass. Also. Oh, 
want some more presents. I like it. <laughs> I should also copy this over, maybe use it somewhere before. I will call this uh, ping lead or support lead. And I think I also want to Add a second reverb unit, or maybe Argot Learner. Yeah, I because I would like to wash it off in the first part. Yeah, I like this. Let's um, let's uh, automate the mix. Now here I want it to be all wet, but later I want it to be dry. So let's do it like this, simply. Also, I would like to add some Lopez filter automation because that's going to make it even more cool. Okay. Wow, it I think it it is working a bit faster overall. This thing is too loud. Yep, it is too loud. It should be. <laughs> I think I'm gonna make a. What I wanna do? Oh! I think I remember. Yes, I wanted to do something with this thing. With this pad, make it quieter, make it like also wash it out. I think I'm gonna do it with a filter. Maybe this time a hypers filter. Very, very gentle hypers filter. How about this? Would it sound good? Yeah, that could sound really cool. <laughs> Alrighty. Let's go from this and make it slowly, slowly go down.
I really like this track, wow. this make the kick have more influence on this sour bass because it is not enough So I want to make me. I want to try and make the kicks louder for this part. How about doing this? Okay, I'm gonna save first. Now V. Oh shit. Oh. Uh, okay, no. <laughs> this doesn't work here. Transform velocity exactly 127. Let's see what that does. These notes are too freaking long. The heck. Okay, let's try and fix it. I don't know if I, if this is possible, but I'll try. MIDI, 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 transform. Set note length to exactly one. Okay, uh, how about 0.5? Oh, will that make him? Oh, okay. 0 0.5 is a. Uh, so I need 0 0.25. Oh, okay. All right. I get it. Uh, I think I can do this. Set note velocity. Uh, no, set notes length to exactly. Okay. 0 0.5 is this. 0 0.25 is what we had. 0.125 is what we need. Yeah.
my I want to do something to make it feel bigger for a while. I'm going to maybe try use a GuitarX multiband compressor. And then I'm going to try to bypass it. So let's see if I can automate the bypass for it because that's it's really important. Uh, I can't. <laughs> Okay, I can't do that, so no, I can't use this plugin. Sorry. <laughs> um, call of multibands is dead. So, or do we have any other multiband compressors in the house? Multiband compressor stereo. Oh, yeah, we have the L LSP compressor. Yeah, let's try it. I never tried it. Oh, it looks nice. Interesting. Wait, yeah. Okay. Let's maybe loop this uh, section so I can just play over and over and can easily. Okay, so, hmm. What is this? Oh crap, we have eight Oh, I can have eight fucking bands. Wow. Pretty rad. Let's go for it. <laughs> Pretty fucking insane, but yeah, I really actually wanted a multi band compressor that can do eight bands. But can I also automate multi, uh, not multi band, can I automate uh, ba bypass for this? Yeah, I can. That's, that's the key. Okay. Can I configure the filters somehow? Uh, can I make this bigger? Oh, nice. Sweet, I can configure every single one. Hmm. Okay, I guess it's gonna take some time to set up. <laughs> okay, ratio. Mm, what is the threshold? Oh, level. All right. Let's unsolo it. Whoa, no. I don't want so much makeup. Nice. Okay, and solo. Mm. Yeah, 
yeah, this is the main. You know what? I'm gonna go to split. <laughs> ratio and knee. Okay, ratio. Hmm, lovely. Now, threshold. Where is the. Oh, attack decibels, okay. Yeah. I think the first one also needs a uh, longer attack. Once you get it, it's pretty awesome. Wow, I didn't even know this exists. This plugin is cool. Does this really bypass? I can't really tell. Okay, it doesn't truly bypass, so that's a problem. Pretty crazy. <laughs> okay. Ah, I see. Okay, I think I would need to use some... Um, oh, I can use this. Awesome. Oh, nice, I can just use this to fill up the space. I don't have to be all wet. That's something I couldn't just do with cough multiband compressor. I think I need makeup gain. It sounds different, it doesn't sound 
I'm not sure if it sounds better. It sounds different. Let's let's try it. I'm gonna save it and let's play this whole thing. I think the bass is too much. Too much highs. What's going on with this? Uh, it should be loud. Will it work? Yay! Let's do it. There has to be something to differentiate the drums in the first part of this and the second one because there's not enough. I think I need to EQ the crash very carefully because there are some tones I don't like. Uh, where are you? There you go. There you are, crash. Like it more.
try and make it. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Oh, shoot. No, 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 no. G. I'd like to make a slight little thingy here and see what happens. about changing the tape stop speed and make it faster. Much faster. Yeah, better. Sweet. Can I do something cool here? <laughs> nice. I think it's a. Uh, I think the track is pretty much done. Uh, yay, yay, yay. Sweet. Nice. Cool. Awesome. I could try some mix bus compression just a tiny bit.
fabulous. All right, I'm just gonna render this and make sure it's it's okay. Oh, where is the session start marker? Oh, there it is. Oh, end session end marker. Yeah. So yeah, thanks for watching. I the rest is just boring stuff. So you have basically watched me do the whole thing, the whole track from start to finish. And you can see how it didn't look like much in the beginning. Oh, it didn't look like much, like for the three quarters of the time. You see, that's that's how it is. You just have to push it further. And finally you arrive at the place where it's cool. I hope that this series was uh, was worth your time and show, shown you quite a lot of different tricks and ideas and how I work. Anyway, thanks for watching. Uh, I will see you in the next video. Bye.